Aloha, we welcome you, our entire Viking family, to a special event happening on Wednesday, April 25th, 2018. Hilo High School is having an important combined PTSA general meeting, SCC community meeting, and two vital half-hour seminars with special speakers on how to help your students handle social media properly and the hazards of using electronic smoking devices, beginning at 5.15 p.m. on Wednesday, April 25th, 2018, in the cafeteria. This combined event is open to all parents, guardians, students, teachers, staff at the school, and all stakeholders in the community. We also welcome students and parents of the incoming freshman class of 2022. You, your students, and your ohana are highly encouraged to attend this meeting, as it will be packed with vital information you need to know about the Hilo High School. The current yearly academic plan and strategic plan will be discussed, along with special committees who will report out on important issues at the school. A free significant meal will be offered to those who RSVP for the event by noon on Wednesday, April 18, 2018. Go to hilohigh.org RSVP 0425 to RSVP. Please let us know how many in your family are attending and if you need to order vegetarian meals. The doors for sign-in will open at 4.15 p.m. on Wednesday, April 25, 2018, and food will be served starting at this time. The official meeting time, including the Hilo High School PTSA general meeting and the school community council meeting will begin at 5.15. The seminars will start at 6 p.m. and conclude by 7 p.m. We hope to see you there. Seniors, listen up. Time is getting closer to that big day. 13 plus years of hard work and hopefully some education has prepared you for what's to come. More hard work. Hilo High has provided you the necessary tools to help you make your mark in society. This is the good news. The not so good news is that each of you will need to start making good choices now. All of you will now need to stay away from committing any class A or B offenses or more than one class C or D offense. What will be the penalty? If you make any bad choices, it is not walking the line. Remember that walking the line is a privilege, not a right. Also, this ceremony is not about you anymore. It's about those individuals who have had your back all of these years. Make good choices and we'll see you on the 18th of May. Good morning Vikings, welcome to your KVIKS Morning Bulletin. My name is Brianna and here are your announcements for Monday, April 16, 2018. Hilo High Store. 
Hey Vikings, today is pizza and Jamba Juice Day, even day. Come to the Hilo High store in A16 right after school to buy some delicious Jamba Juice and pizza. Don't be late. Senior OEVA practice. Seniors, we need your help. On Tuesdays and Thursdays, we will gather during lunch recess to practice OEVA in Ms. Gucci's room, C106. Whether you know it or not, please, we need your presence. Recycling and helping dogs. Remember what we told you last week about recycling? Well, there is another way you, that you can do this. Take your bottles and cans from home to, and take them to Mr. K's on Kinoli Street. Tell them you want to donate the proceeds of your bottles and cans to Rainbow Friends. They will actually send a check to Rainbow Friends. Thank you for your support. Did you know how serious crime dog fighting is? According to Lisa Kubota at Hawaii News Now, the Class C felony carries a penalty of up to five years in prison and the maximum $10,000 fine. Hawaii is now probably has the strong dog Get dog fighting law of the 50 states, said Sen. Clayton He, chair of the Senate Judiciary and Labor Committee. It is illegal for people to arrange dog fights or allow them in on their property. The new law makes cruelty to animals by fighting dogs in the first degree a class B felony, which is punishable up by two to 20 years in prison and a fine up to $25,000. The Hawaiian Humane Society is offering a $5,000 reward for any tip that leads to an arrest and conviction related to dog fighting. It is important to know that it is a very rare underground activity, so if anyone knows of a fight that's going to occur, to call us and I can assure you that we will keep their information confidential. Tips are being taken by the Hawaiian Humane Society at 356-2250 or Animal Crime Stoppers at 955-8300. Don't be late. Senior OEVA practice. Seniors, we need your help. On Tuesdays and Thursdays, we will gather during lunch recess to practice OEVA in Ms. Gucci's room, C106. Whether you know it or not, please, we need your presence. Recycling and helping dogs. Remember what we told you last week about recycling? Well, there is another way you, that you can do this. Take your bottles and cans from home to, and take them to Mr. K's on Kinoli Street. Tell them you want to donate the proceeds of your bottles and cans to Rainbow Friends. They will actually send a check to Rainbow Friends. Thank you for your support. Did you know how serious crime dog fighting is? According to Lisa Kubota at Hawaii News Now, the Class C felony carries a penalty of up to five years in prison and the maximum $10,000 fine. Hawaii is now probably has the strong dog, get, dog fighting law of the 50 states, said Sen. Clayton He, chair of the Senate Judiciary and Labor Committee. It is illegal for people to arrange dog fights or allow them in on their property. The new law makes cruelty to animals by fighting dogs in the first degree a class B felony, which is punishable up by two to 20 years in prison and a fine up to $25,000. The Hawaiian Humane Society is offering a $5,000 reward for any tip that leads to an arrest and conviction related to dog fighting. It is important to know that it is a very rare underground activity, so if anyone knows of a fight that's going to occur, to call us and I can assure you that we will keep their information confidential. Tips are being taken by the Hawaiian Humane Society at 356-2250 or Animal Crime Stoppers at 955-8300. Sophomore OEVA Practices. Attention sophomore class. The class of 2020 will be holding OEVA song and dance practices in the lower patios Mondays, Wednesdays, Fridays, immediately after school. Please come out and show your class spirit and pride. Class of 2020 t-shirts. Listen up sophomores, we are looking for a new design for our class t-shirt for our junior year. Your designs need to be submitted on a white sheet of paper and need to be bold and big. Please do not have any fine lines in your designs as they will not show when printed. Please incorporate a lion and also a 2020 somewhere in your design. And remember, your class color is black and gold. Again, the designs need to be original drawings and nothing from the internet or copyrighted images. Please drop off your designs in room A12B. We'll be accepting designs from now until April 27th. Freshmen. Hey freshmen, meet at the pool during lunch recess every Tuesday, Wednesday, and Friday for our 
OEVA practice. Let's work together to put the best possibility performance we can. Come to the pool during lunch on those days, Tuesdays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. And now, a special May Day announcement. Aloha, hiloha ohana. If you did not know, by now, our first annual OEVA competition is on Monday, April 30th. And that date is quickly approaching. This competition is meant to build pride and unity school-wide and will be judged by distinguished and proud alumni of our Hilo High School. There will also be special guests that are excited to see each class's final presentation. And you never know, there may be a worthwhile performance that you will need to be there to see. So to ensure that we are all ready next week, we will have a modified schedule to accommodate whole grade practice sessions through STARS classes. On Monday, April 16th, the schedule will remain the same and the STARS period will be after recess. Seniors will still report to the pool area during recess through STARS for their graduation song practice. All other grades will report to their regular STARS classes at that time. From Tuesday, April 17th through Friday, April 20th, all students will report to their STARS classes after the first period of the day. So on Tuesday and Thursday, after period one, students report directly to their STARS classes. On Wednesday and Friday, students will go directly to their STARS classes after period two. From there, STARS teachers will take attendance and then walk together to designated grade level locations. Here are the locations for each grade level for each day. Tuesday, 9th grade, cafeteria. 10th grade, auditorium. 11th grade, pool. 12th grade, new gym. Wednesday, 9th grade, cafeteria. 10th grade, auditorium. 11th grade, new gym. 12th grade, pool. Thursday, 9th grade, cafeteria, 10th grade, new gym, 11th grade, pool, 12th grade, auditorium. Friday, 9th grade, new gym, 10th grade, auditorium, 11th grade, pool, 12th grade, cafeteria. This schedule is also available in all classrooms. We hope that everyone is excited and ready to bring it. Mahalo nui loa. Today's menu. Maple pancake wrap or pork patty with a biscuit and gravy peaches, dried cranberries. Today's lunch is hot dog and whole grain bun and tater tots, house salad and apple wedges with a shortbread cookie. Thank you for watching KVIKS. Want to keep up to date with Hilo High School? Follow us on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram and YouTube at Hilo High School. Have a great day Vikings!